right. How about a little local food for you this morning? Yeah, I'd you know? love I'd love something that's not chicken soup that I've had the last six days. <laughs> I had something with some sustenance to and it. And it's almost breakfast time, so we'll show you one of uh, your local options. Tango's Tacos has a couple locations here in town. Mm -hmm. We're going to check in with Pro News 7's Jacob Bradford to see what he's up to. Jacob? Hey guys, good morning. We're out here at Tango's Tacos off of Western Street and standing next to the owner, or co-owner, Mark Prickett. Um, and you're going to be teaching us a little bit of how to make a breakfast burrito. 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 Yep. So what do we need to start off with first? You got to start off with the fresh ingredients, the fresh, egg, fresh cracked eggs, potatoes, fresh made pico, cheese, and then your choice of meats. Well, I'm, I'm from Louisiana, so what is pico? What is that? Pico de gallo is tomatoes, onions, jalapenos, cilantro, and spices. Okay, so we got to start off with the burrito and then we go straight into it. Right. Okay. Start off with your tortilla. So we got our tortillas here. It's labeled for me. Here's this one for you. All right. And here's this one for you. Okay, so we got. Now, when did you guys start your business? We opened the first Tango's Taco Shop in September of 2011. September of 2011? Yes. Okay, now what do you usually put on first? Is okay. there an order? You want to start with your eggs. Okay. Because we're making our one pound burrito here. That's a whole pound? It is a full pound. Okay. I have had people challenge me, pull out the scale, and it is a one pound burrito. So no subway no, thing going no, on no here. No subway going, going <laughs> on here. You're going to get a full pound. Okay. So then okay. we start off with what? And you go to your potatoes. Potatoes. Oh, so there is an order to it, kind of. Kind of? Kind of. You can do it in whatever order you like. It's all going to be mushed up in there anyway? Yep. All right. And then the? The meat choice. You want to go with sausage? Okay. I'm going to go with brisket. Brisket. Oh, does it matter? Oh, you can put whatever you want on it? Yeah, you can choose your meats. We've got your choice of brisket, sausage, pork, bacon, uh, chorizo. So whatever you want to put on a Whatever you want to put on it. Breakfast items, put in a tortilla, and it's pretty much a breakfast burrito. You got it. Okay. <laughs> All right, and then I'm going to put a little bit of bacon on it. Okay. Because everybody loves bacon. Sure, sure. I challenge Brisket's anybody. Brisket's my personal favorite. Brisket. So. What is brisket? That is, it's kind of like a meat that's not... It's like a ground up meat? No, no, no. It's, no. it's, it's a full side. I, I'm not sure which part of the cow it is, to uh -huh. be honest with you, but it's, it's one that's got to be slow cooked or it's going to be real tough. So we, we cook our brisket overnight and it's, it's a very slow cooked meat. Very slow cooked. And then it's mm -hmm. just... Then it's nice and tender and juicy. You know, when I first came out to Texas, my, my, uh, my aunt said, she was like, we're going to have brisket for dinner. Mm -hmm. And I went up to my mom and I said, why are we having biscuits? <laughs> I, mean, I had no idea what it was. Okay, so then okay. the challenging part, because I okay. think I'm pretty well fitted. No, I'm not. But you got to put your pico de gallo in. Okay. I mean, that's, that's your choice. I like a lot of pico de gallo in mine. Okay. Now, does it have a little bit of spices in it? It does have a little bit of spice with the jalapeno in it. Okay. Now, for the challenging part, is the wrapping it up. The challenging part is the wrapping the burrito. Okay. Now, to do that right, you start on both ends. Okay. Fold it in. Okay. You get your thumbs underneath. Okay. Roll it over. Tuck it here, okay, and then give it a good roll, and then it's done. And then you've got it sealed on both sides, so it doesn't make a huge mess when you take a bite. Wow, and it is pretty much a full pound. Awesome. Full pound. All right, well, thank you so much. And when we Absolutely. come back, we'll be showing you how to make a waffle, a, a breakfast waffle taco. Breakfast waffle taco. Something I think you'll only find here at Tango. <laughs> All right. Well, keep watching Daybreak, guys. Back to you.